Hello and welcome back to Actual Edge, your source for the latest medical advancements. Before we start, don't forget to like, subscribe and share the video. Today, we are delving into new treatments for erectile dysfunction, an issue affecting a significant number of men. Remember, these alternatives are still evolving, so let's explore these game changers for men with erection concerns. Erectile dysfunction is a common issue affecting a large percentage of men as they age. While medications like sildenafil and tadalafil are well-known solutions, today we're discussing alternative treatments for those seeking for different options. First on the list is Firmtech, a penile ring connected to an app that acts like a Fitbit for your penis. Urologist Robert Valenzuela recommends it to monitor the intensity, duration and frequency of erections and orgasms, allowing users to identify factors influencing their sexual response. Another groundbreaking option is shockwave therapy, where sound waves stimulate healing and growth factors, creating new blood vessels and tissue. Urological surgeon Lana Chuk suggests vocal therapy for its effectiveness in penetrating and treating specific tissue within the penis. Platelet-rich plasma, or PRP, involves drawing blood, isolating platelet-rich plasma and injecting it into the penis. A 2021 study showed significant improvements in erectile function for those receiving PRP. Botox, known for its cosmetic uses, has shown promise in improving erectile firmness. By injecting Botox into penile tissues, it relaxes them facilitating blood flow and leading them to easier erections. The treatment is relatively quick and lasts from 6 months to a year. Stem cell therapy, a versatile treatment used for various conditions, has recently emerged as a potential option for erectile dysfunction. While still considered experimental, early results are promising, especially for mild or situational cases. Gene therapy, a cutting-edge approach, involves injecting genes into the penis to enhance erectile function. However, this treatment is still in early stages, with research mostly limited to rodent studies. Urological surgeon Lana Chuk advises caution considering gene therapy as experimental. These new treatments for erectile dysfunction showcase the evolving landscape of men's health. While some are in early stages and others are considered experimental, they offer hope for those seeking alternative to traditional medication and therapies. Stay informed with Actual Edge, your guide to the latest in medical breakthroughs. Thank you for joining us.